Let's talk about the shortcut to easily find the major modes throughout the fretboard. So let's start by using a C major or the C Ionian there, right? Now, when you want to find the C Lydian, just count five notes from that scale. One, two, three, four, five. And then you're going to land that on G. So then you can get the same shape and start on G now. C, D, E, F, G. And that is your C Lydian mode. You can do the same thing to find the C Mixolydian, but instead counting five, just count four. One, two, three, four. You're going to be landing that on the F. Same shape. And then you have your C Mixolydian. So you got C Ionian, C Lydian, C Mixolydian. Now, of course, if I play those scales just up and down the way that I'm playing, they just sound like major scales. So the difference is always going to be application. Okay? So if you do know those modes already and you can easily find them on the fretboard, book a lesson with your favorite teacher and ask to be shown how to apply those modes now. Okay? This is just an easy lesson to, for us to be able to find those modes throughout the fretboard. Let's pick a different example now. Let's use the E scale because then we can use that low E to let that note ring throughout the scale so we can have a better idea of how those modes are going to sound. So this is the E. To find the E Lydian, five notes ahead, one, two, three, four, five, takes us to a B. Now we hear a little bit more of that modal sound, right? And same thing with the E Mixolydian. One, two, three, four, just four this time. Takes us to an A note. We can apply the same shape over the A. And hear the modal sound. So have fun with the lesson getting good about hearing those different modes. And once again, as soon as you get good with them, book a lesson and go through applications now.